on the run is the latest EP from Thugger, Young Thug, Jeffrey uh, uh, Tamba. He has come very soon after the release of his last album, Slime Language, which I did review on this channel too. I do talk about Thugger quite a bit whenever he drops something because um, he's one of the guys in the game that is certainly way more unique and eccentric than most other like trap rappers right now or mumble rappers mumble and i think most music nerds at this point have kind of come to the agreement that thugger is certainly way more interesting than the many many of the uh, people in his lane right now you could even argue that he's not even really in a lane he's kind of doing his own thing and slime language just felt incredibly gimmicky for his style. It was just everything he's done already with less interesting ideas. The hooks were barely there on most of the tracks. The features, in my, I, I mean, I thought the features were pretty weak, but I did see a lot of people praise the features, but um, they, they weren't really for me. And so on the run, already dropped. A bit of hype to this one because of the Elton John feature. Um, I remember going into this track thinking, oh my sh fuck, is, is Elton John really here? Like, and I'm pretty sure that was the marketing ploy behind this because, of course, they had pictures and stuff meeting up and all that kind of stuff. But it, sadly, he was, he's not there. He's just not there. But he is technically there because of the sample of Rocket Man, which is interpolated in one of the most intriguing ways I could have ever imagined. The way the vocals get stretched out, um, you know, for a longer than they do in the actual song and they're manipulated. It's like, It's so intoxicating with the musical backdrop as well, with those little like <laughs> scaring like trap beats going on. It, it, it really works, and Thugger sounds really good on this track. And I just really like the moody atmosphere that he got, like he, that he gave this track. It really is quite a nice listen. It's really something that I, can, I think could have easily fucked up. Like it's one of those occurrences where like this could go either way, and actually. I, I commend Thugger here because this works so well. And it's not even the best track here, surprisingly. I think the opening two tracks are way more flavorful in terms of the sounds that um, Thugger has. And he's just on point with a lot of these beats. I mean, he's not as wild and chaotic as some might want him to be because of the Jeffrey mixtape that he dropped a few years back was like his highest peak of wildness which I don't think he's quite matched since then, but I still think he actually flows over these tracks better than he has done on anything I've heard in ages. I mean, that super slimy mixtape with Future was all right, but Future, I thought, was dragging Thugger down a little bit. But there was never really that many moments where Thugger sounded like, ooh. But here, like, he's not quite as, like, dynamic, but I still think he's just kind of, like, restrained himself and he sounds pretty cool. I do have to say though that the track with Jaden Smith uh, has a pretty bland beat. I don't really feel like there's much to this one, but um, it's only really one dud in the track list. Jaden Smith's fine on the song, to be honest. I don't really think there's anything wrong with his feature. I just think it's the sound of the song. The sonic palette just has nothing really to offer in comparison to the really high moments on this EP. I mean, you can't really top that like synth beat on Icy with their It's so fucking catchy, but like, again, it's not as over the top as what you expect from Thugger, but like, there's something controlled about it. I feel like he put a lot more effort into this like mini EP here, as opposed to, he, as opposed to the friggin like 15 track length album that only came out like two months ago or something. It's just bizarre to me how the quality can jump up so much after a few months and this is your EP. Like, uh, Thugger needs to be way more consistent, man, because he could drop like a, a really stellar album if he wanted to, but every time he gets given that opportunity, he just never hits the mark. 
But here we've got a really nice, solid set of tracks that, you know, only goes on for like 20 minutes, but it's a, some of the best music he's made in ages. I think one of the main reasons as to why his hype has died down like quite significantly over the past year or so is because of like the lack of intrigue that he puts into his albums. Like you always just expect the same thing and if you don't get that you get a lesser version of what you were hoping. And while this EP isn't close to being perfect, I still think it's a really solid set of tracks. Like sure I'm not really loving the whole thing but I would say that I think it's a really really solid EP. I like the way Amp sings up with his vocals on tracks like uh, Reel In My Veins. Um, this is one where he's like targeting critics a little bit, sort of like, hey, you know, I'm, I'm one of the founders, you're, you're attacking me, you're saying my music ain't good, and I was one of the earliest people in this game. And it's not in that annoying kind of way that like a lot of rappers might do in the sense like, yeah, I built everything from nothing, I'm the best around, you can't insult me. It's just more of a bit like of a little jab, and I just like the way he's yelping at this sort of little mini section of the song. But like I said, it's just a really strong EP, solid set of tracks, a real nice surprise to close out the EP too with that uh, Elton John sample. Very unexpected and could have ended up being terrible as I already said, but it works out really well. So yeah, I do recommend this if you're a Thugger fan and you're kind of, you know, maybe a little bored of his uh, latest releases and have been unimpressed with a lot of his work for the for a while I would say this EP might pleasantly surprise you because it certainly did for me as I always say I don't really score EPs or anything like that I usually just leave it unscored because you know there are only like six tracks to talk about or whatever but it's a solid EP that's gonna make my year-end list for sure on the EP list and uh, yeah Thugger Thugger Thugger's coming through here, he's on the right path. Let me know your thoughts on this EP, if you liked it as much as I did, if you didn't like it, let me know about the Elton John track too, I feel like that's gonna split a lot of people. Uh, yeah, it's, 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 it's a polarizing track, so yeah, let me know. Let me know your thoughts, have a good day, have a good day, have a good day.